Hey guys, Info Rockstar back here. I'm going to do a video on adjusting the pitch and tempo of your sound file on any given track. And just so you know, if you have several different sound files on the same track, you can adjust the pitch and the tempo of each individual file within that soundtrack. It's pretty simple. Just highlight the soundtrack you want to adjust by just touching it with your, with your touchpad on your laptop, your left click on your mouse. Just gotta hit it one time, then go to sound. See, here's um, your project tempo, the detected tempo. Basically, it's 141. 140 over 9999, okay? It's the key of G. Um, you can adjust all kinds of different things within here. You can change the, the key. You can change the tempo. Uh, in this case, we we can also change the semitones. This is the drum track. This is the acoustic guitar track. Hear how it sounds. These are just preloaded mixed craft sounds, by the way. Both of them are 141 beats per minute. So let's say that we wanted to make our guitar a little faster. Well, that's pretty cool. Just, you can adjust the tempo. Just however you want to. Make it faster. Let's meet this. You want it really fast? The higher the number, the faster the beat. Now, remember, it was 141 beats per minute. I changed this to 100. I'll change this to 100. Now, we can also, like let's say, we want the pitch to be a little higher. We can go from here, zero is default, that's where it's, the sound file's default is. Let's say we want it to be really high. Completely change the tempo. It'll probably be better noticed on the guitar track but it's not allowing us the option on the guitar track Let's see just pitch by now we've got cinema tone let's try it this way this is going to be the guitar track now you can also just hit the arrow button And that's pretty much it. Um, you could also do it with vocal tracks. Like, let's say I wanted to record something. Welcome to Mixcraft. Okay. I want to zoom in. Welcome to Mix. Welcome to Mixcraft. Okay, it's not very loud, is it? Let's just adjust the volume properties. Okay, let's see how much louder that is. Welcome to Mixcraft. Okay. Welcome to Mixcraft. Let me adjust this. Welcome to Mixcraft. Okay, check it out. 
to mix craft to mix craft I'm gonna split this to mix craft to mix craft okay mix craft 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 okay right there you'll see where I put a marker I'm gonna split this too now watch I want this to sound a little bit screwed so go negative 4 on that one and negative 12 on this one let me max this out because it's not gonna be very loud <clears throat> Welcome to Mixed Craft. To Mixed Craft. Let's see. Welcome to Mixed Craft. Now check this out. You want to make your voice sound like the chipmunks? Whoops, that's not what I wanted to do. Back to 100. This is what I wanted to do. Welcome to Mixed Craft. You can play around with this and make it sound really cool. Welcome. That's on 12. Let's go to 4. Let's go to negative four. Welcome to Mixed Craft. So you could really, you know, play around with it and adjust your key, your pitch. Remember, you got to click time stretch by or uh, adjust pitch by. Uh, no, time stretch by is up here. Um, like if you just cl used project key, it'll you won't be able to mess with the semitones so just click adjust pitch by just stretch by now project tempo will eliminate that just pitch key project key will eliminate that but let's say you've made your sound file the way that you want it just highlight that right click merge to new clip that will attach all your all of your files with all of your edits in them so that it's one solid file welcome to next craft so, that is, in general, uh, an introduction to how to adjust, you know, your pitch and your key um, and your tempo. So, if you have any questions or comments, leave them at the bottom. I'll be sure to answer them. And uh, if you know any tips or tricks, share them with them. Share them with us by putting them in the comments. Thank you.